President Biden inherited a vaccine, a distribution plan, trillions of dollars in funding, but unfortunately this administration has chosen to put all its eggs in one basket, prioritized unconstitutional vaccine mandates and testing. Yet comparing 2021 to 2022, COVID infections have increased 72% and deaths increased 27%. This we know, if you look at this data, your current plan is not working. The current plan is not working. We need therapeutics at warp speed. Ms. O'Connell, who is responsible for this failure? Senator Marshall, thank you for that question. Uh, we are making six therapies available uh, to the American people uh, free of Who's charge. Who's responsible for the failure? Senator Marshall, we continue to make therapies available at warp speed to the American people. The Biden administration has allocated over $80 billion for testing and only $15 billion on therapeutics. It's obvious that your plan has failed. We can't keep throwing good money after bad money. This is insanity. We have to admit our mistakes and go a different direction. Ms. McConnell, would you commit to an Operation Warp Speed for therapeutics? Senator Marshall, thank you. Uh, therapeutics are part of Operation Warp Speed, and that's how we have the six therapies that we're currently making available to states free of charge. They'll be available after Delta is, is already been come and gone and also after of course, Omicron will be said and done as well. Dr. Fauci, 59% of Americans and 81% of Republicans do not have a favorable opinion of you. Frankly, honestly, you've lost your reputation. The American people don't trust the words coming out of your mouth. Every day you appear on TV, you do more damage than good when it comes to educating the public on COVID. Suppose you were leading a team in an effort to try to get people to stop smoking cigarettes. But every time your spokesperson goes on television, over half the nation goes out and buys a pack of Marlboros. Wouldn't you stop that person from appearing on national television? Once again, Senator Marshall, I believe that's a real distortion of the reality. If you look at everything that I've said on TV, it is to validate, encourage, and get people to abide by the recommendations of the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. Look at everything I've ever said. Yeah, Dr. Fauci, I get understand that, but, but perception is tested. reality. Yeah. And you're hurting the team right uh, now. Yeah. You are hurting the team right now. 